how an achievable dream changed my life. It gave me hope, it gave me opportunities, and ultimately gave me a future. And for me, that made all the difference. As chairman of an Achievable Dreams Middle and High School's Board of Directors, I take this moment to express our appreciation for you. We are incredibly proud of the work we continue to do together. An Achievable Dream is the definition of a community partnership, and our leadership could not be more proud of the way this community has stepped up to support an Achievable Dream throughout the pandemic. Together we know we will continue to create bright futures for many more generations of dreamers. Friends, Thank you for believing in the work of an achievable dream, and thank you for your support. On behalf of the Board of Directors of an Achievable Dream, I want to thank you for your unfailing support. We are so proud of all we have accomplished together over the last year and a half. No matter what the future brings, we stay focused on the mission of providing everything dreamers need to be successful in school and in life. Dreamers continue to achieve great things, and that is made possible by this community. From all of us at Achievable Dream, thank you for your support. As we all know, the past two years have been a roller coaster with many ups and downs, and maybe even a little bit of terrified screaming. As we navigated the many changes that came our way, we kept one question at the forefront of our work. What is in the best interest of our students and their families? This was and continues to be our main focus. Another area in which we were forced to shift and adapt was our special events. It was impossible to gather large groups together and our car dealer partners who provide vehicles as auction items found themselves lacking in vehicles. Of course this posed a problem. We initially postponed and then made the decision to cancel our 29th annual tennis ball gala. We knew it was the right decision but one thing quickly became evident. Our sponsors and supporters would not let a pandemic or a canceled gala stand in the way of our dreamers receiving the support and resources they needed. As you will see in this video, our supporters and sponsors went above and beyond. At times, words would fail me when I would hang up the phone after talking to yet another sponsor who confirmed that they would maintain their level of support no matter what. Nearly every single sponsor kept their event sponsorship intact, even when we weren't able to hold an in-person event. They did this because they believe in the mission and work of an achievable dream, and because they see every day the difference made and the lives changed. Words really do fall short, but one thing remains abundantly clear. We could not do this without you. And thanks to you, our dreamers can continue to thrive. From all of us at An Achievable Dream, thank you for your support. An Achievable Dream has offered me many opportunities to experience new things. I wasn't leaning towards the college route. Third grade when I started to now, I've been able to learn so many things from Achievable Dream and I'm nothing but grateful for what they've done for me. As we mark another year of our new normal, we honor the many sponsors and supporters who make it possible for our dreamers to not only dream, but go on to achieve their dreams. This year, our students and staff faced many obstacles, and they overcame them with resilience. Our graduating class experienced the challenges of navigating their junior and senior year during the pandemic, but they rose above. Our alumni face a world filled with uncertainty and unrest, yet they set an example of determination and integrity that we can all learn from. Throughout all of this, an achievable dream has continued to grow, and we carry with us the blueprint for success. 
our deep belief in the mission and vision of an achievable dream, in our commitment to doing whatever it takes for students to succeed. We are immensely proud of our team and our students for all they have and will continue to achieve. As you consider your impact, think of an achievable dream and the thousands of lives you are changing through your support. At Town Bank, we are proud to serve others and enrich lives through initiatives that support our communities. One of our longest standing relationships is with an achievable dream. We so deeply believe in the impact of this program, and we've seen firsthand the thousands of lives change through their work. That is true community impact. When the 29th annual tennis ball was canceled, we knew without a doubt that we would maintain our support, and we look forward to continue to invest in the community together. Town Bank remains a proud supporter of an achievable dream. Smithfield is a proud partner of an achievable dream and their work to bring equity to education. At Smithfield, we value diversity, equity, and inclusion in everything we do. We believe in investing in our community in meaningful ways. Without a doubt, the show must go on with or without a tennis ball gala. Dreamers must continue to dream and achieve. We are proud to help inspire hope through education for the students of an achievable dream. Ferguson is a longtime partner of an achievable dream, and we're proud to continue our joint efforts to educate, influence, and develop the next generation of leaders in our community. An achievable dream embodies what it means to provide equity to education. It's proof that given access to the same opportunities and resources, young people can achieve remarkable things regardless of their circumstances. To the graduating class of 2022, You've worked so hard to reach this point. You've shown up daily, overcome obstacles, and remained focused. Congratulations. Feel great about what you've accomplished. You've established a solid foundation for future success. On behalf of Ferguson and our 31,000 associates across North America, we wish you much success as you take your next step toward achieving your dreams. And I hope to see at least some of you as future Ferguson associates. Riverside has been caring for our communities for over a century. And with each passing year, we have renewed our mission to care for others as we would care for those we love. And Riverside loves an achievable dream and our dreamers. We are proud of our partnership with an achievable dream since its beginning and proud to not only maintain, but increase our sponsorship support in place of the traditional tennis ball gala. Riverside proudly continues to partner with an achievable dream and together we are making a lasting impact in the community. The Rotary Club of the Virginia Peninsula and an Achievable Dream have a long history of making a difference together. As an original sponsor and partner of the annual Tennis Ball Gala, our club has partnered for nearly 30 years on important fundraising efforts to ensure the students of an Achievable Dream had everything they needed to succeed. Rotary is about taking action to create lasting change across the globe and in our communities. Though the pandemic brought difficult times, an achievable dream continued to serve its students, and Rotary is proud to continue its support and partnership in this important work. Well, before achievable dream, I used to switch schools every school year, and it was hard for me to get comfortable, to make friends, to feel welcome, because it was never stable. Achievable dream made me feel welcome, to have like a foundation to go off of, and it helped me build my path, what to expect after high school, and what I want to do career-wise. It built that foundation for me, and I appreciate it. Hello, I'm Mark Casey, the president of the Casey Auto Group. I want to talk to you about an achievable dream. Founded in 1992 by Walter Siegeloff and a group of business leaders in the community that Walter got together. 30 years later, 30 years later, Thousands have been helped to grow to be fine citizens. Donations are a big part of the Achievable Dream success. The tennis ball raised thousands of dollars. A big part of that were cars sold at auction at the tennis ball, donated by local dealers. Pandemic hit, cars didn't come in. Even after the pandemic, shortage of chips. So as a result of that, there's a shortage of cars. The Casey Auto Group has been giving cars for 30 years. We have increased our cash donations in lieu of cars. By investing in an achievable dream, we're making an impact on our young citizens for many, many years to come. Together, 
we can continue to inspire hope for thousands of students at the Achievable Dream. As you can see, our tennis ball sponsors will do whatever it takes to ensure our students succeed. I would like to especially recognize Town Bank, Smithfield, Ferguson Enterprises, and Riverside Health System. A special thank you to Art Casey of Casey Auto Group and Tommy Meehan of CD Weston Company. Lastly, I would like to thank our partners at the Rotary Club of the Virginia Peninsula. We are so grateful for the support of these and many more sponsors of all levels. I would like to thank our board of directors for their unwavering support. Everything we do comes back to our students. And I know that our founder, the late Walter Siegeloff, would be so proud of what our dreamers are accomplishing and his vision continues to live on. For our dreamers, your support is just the beginning of their journey. So when I think about the beginning, I think about downtown Newport News, 16th Street. Bad news is what they call it. I'm not sure if they still call it that, but what I can say is some good news came out of this story. So let's talk about the foundation. Um, and the foundation that I want to speak on is the foundation that I got from the An Achievable Dream Academy. And I really want to stop there for a second and really talk about that a little bit more simply because this foundation is the foundation that is built the man that you see in front of you today. Let's start at third grade. When I got into the program, I saw immediately the structure change. And that structure change, what I mean was there was a lot of discipline and consistency, you know, that I was not really used to. Young black kid from downtown Newport News, Virginia, exposed to so many things I should not have been exposed to. Um, violence, domestic abuse, uh, drugs, you know, so many other things that were just negative around me. And because of those things, you know, I, at one point I honestly believed this is what life is. You know, this is my surroundings. This is my reality at this point. Not understanding that it's truly not my reality, just my current circumstances and that those circumstances could potentially change. And when I realized that these circumstances could actually potentially change, was when I was exposed to the In Achievable Dream program. Because now I have a different structure, I have a different outlook on life, because I'm exposed to so many different things that was technically, literally, a block away from where I stayed uh, downtown. I stayed in the 800 block, which is literally one block away from the downtown campus, uh, Dunbar Irwin, where In Achievable Dream program started for me. But to think about how that foundation from third grade learning the skill set, learning the sport uh, of tennis and falling in love with the sport, not only did it help me stay out of trouble, you know, which was very important in my community, um, doing other things outside of just hanging with friends and uh, family members outside of school, I was now kind of introduced to individuals who did everything with enthusiasm. And I mean that. I mean to the point where you're getting off the bus, to the line where you're shaking individuals' hands, that could be the sheriff, the police officer, military crew as well. And being able to look another man and right in his eyes and give him a firm handshake. Um, these were lessons and things that I were taught that now introduced to at a young age when I started you know, into the program. I have my class, I had orchestra, I was introduced to the orchestra while I'm playing the violin, the bass, the cello, things of that nature. Now I'm in different places. I remember going to Nashville, going to Tennessee, and being introduced to the game of chess at an early age. Now understanding how things aren't always physical, but there's a mental side to things as well. So being introduced to those things early on, it allowed me the opportunity to go to college. I was introduced to Virginia State University, and 
I was awarded a scholarship to play football and tennis. So to think about how I was exposed to this sport at a young age and this opportunity, you know, came to me, it was really life changing. So graduating college, you know, four year degree, graduated with, a, I wanna say a 3.2 GPA, I believe that's what, cum laude. Um, I was able to really sit back and think about all the educators, all the administrative assistants that helped me along the way get to where I am and the foundation that the An Achievable Dream program gave me when it came to structure, right? It came to discipline, it came to how to handle success and how to handle failure as well through all of the teachings, not only from the athletic side, but also the academic side, which really helped me become the man who I am. And the man who I am today, I am a loving husband. Um, I have three beautiful children, ages of 11, four, and three. Uh, and it's different for me really because I didn't grow up having my father around all the time. You know, so it was a little different having a family of my own. I've never seen marriage, if that makes sense. I've never seen how to truly take care of a child. Even while I was a child, you know, um, based on the community and my surroundings, things were always in disarray, I would say, uh, sometimes. So I had to figure it out on my own. And I look back and think about the lessons that are taught. Um, I remember Mr. Blackman. Uh, I called him MLB because he always had, uh, what was it, the monogram on his shirt that said MLB. And I thought, Major League Baseball, that's the only thing I knew. But I remember him having a conversation with me and sat down and said, you don't have to be a rapper, you don't have to be an actor to be a Major League baller. And what he explained to me was that hard work beats talent when talent doesn't work hard. And that one lesson alone is what got me through a lot of different things because one thing I knew I could control was how hard I worked. And that's one thing um, I was able to do, not only getting to high school, getting to college, but even getting into the corporate world where I wanted to kind of grow in the ladder from entry level to mid-level to leadership positions as well. So I want to say thank you for those opportunities. Um, I also, you know, want to pinpoint, um, I, want to, I call him Mr. North Carolina a t Mr. Hodge, because little did he, does he know, but he impacted my life as well. It was an opportunity where at a young age, I was going to have the opportunity to go to my first NFL game. So I can remember, you know, going home and think, what am I going to wear? What am I going to wear? And cannot find anything to wear. So I put on a yellow shirt because we're going to see the Washington Redskins. I'm thinking yellow, maroon is close, right? So I get there. He sees what's on my shirt. He pulls me to the side and tells me, young man, you are not a thug. And then it doesn't resonate as it does to today because what he instilled in, in me was that, you know, someone's perception of you does not have to be your reality. And then that helped me take things to another level. But I also want to talk about Mr. Coleman. I mean, not Mr. Coleman, but Mr. Who's Talking Coleman. That's the perfect name for him. Uh, Mr. Coleman, I want to thank you for the opportunities where I could talk to my principal. And that was different for me because at a young age, your principal was almost like a celebrity. So being able to talk to your principal and your principal, you know, gives you different values and different missions and goals. And also occasionally, you know, I beat him in tennis a few times too. So I'm gonna leave that right there. But to Ms. Vreeland, I wanna say thank you. I'm gonna start there because I don't know what I would've done without you in a lot of situations, whether it was tennis camps, football camps, whether it was getting to class on time, uh, whether it was eating during the day, coming to your office to see if you had any more neutral grain bars, and now seeing where you are now, being the CEO, and uh, again, I can't think of anyone else who you know, would be more suitable for that position simply because of your love for the people. So to the and Achieve a Dream program, I wanna say thank you. Thank you for helping this young man build a strong foundation, not only in academics, not only in sports, but also in life. And with the lessons that I was taught through this program, I wanna utilize those resources and continue to benefit others around me.
An achievable dream makes me feel confident about my future because they help support me with my future goals and future aspirations. Now I present to you the achievable dream class in 2022. Achievable dream makes me feel valued because of the care and respect I get from the teachers. An achievable dream makes me feel prepared because they ensure that I have a good education. An achievable dream makes me feel safe because everyone is close to me and everyone knows me. An achievable dream makes me feel loved because they care about my future. Achievable dream always makes me feel supported because they always take the time to help their students. A silver dream makes me feel at home because we're a family. An achievable dream makes me feel important because we are a family. Every year, an individual, group, family, or company makes a very special commitment to sponsor college scholarships for the entire graduating class of DREAMers. They become that year's class sponsor. Nearly 15 years ago, a wonderful couple who were longtime supporters of an achievable dream made the decision to create an endowed fund for a unique purpose for future classes under special circumstances. 
They have already sponsored the classes of 2009 and 2010. This couple embodied humility and a heart to serve in the background, avoiding the spotlight and choosing instead to quietly invest in the future generation of dreamers. That is why I am proud to announce the class sponsors of the class of 2022 as the late N.C. Hardy and Linda Hardy. N.C. Hardy, who passed away in 2016, was a special friend to our late founder, Walter Siegeloff. In fact, N.C. and Walter had known each other for so long that it feels like their friendship grew up together. As anyone who knew him would tell you, Walter would ask anyone for anything, but he never had to ask NC for support. NC and Linda were so eager to support an achievable dream because they believed so deeply in what the organization was doing for their community. I don't think I've ever met a kinder, more gracious, or more humble man than NC Hardy. His wife of 50 years, Linda, was proud to carry on their passion for supporting the students of an achievable dream. NC's legacy lives on, and his wife, Linda, is joyfully cheering on the class of 2022 with pride. We know that NC and Linda Hardy scholars will go on to achieve greatness. Jim Rohn once said, the most selfish thing you can do is help someone else. I didn't understand what that meant. At a young age, I was also told that it's better to give than to receive. Not understanding what that meant either. Because I know growing up uh, as a child, when it's time for Christmas, I wanted to receive a lot of Christmas gifts. But what I've learned over time and the lessons that were taught to me through the program, I understand how giving starts the receiving process. To all the individuals who not only contribute their time, their sweat equity, and also their money, we want to say thank you because your investment is truly changing lives. Thank you to the An Achieve a Dream Academy and the program for helping this young man build a foundation of hope. You've heard from some of our sponsors and you've caught a glimpse of the many places our dreamers will go. There is no limit to what we can achieve together. We are the dream family and we are grateful for your support. To all of our sponsors, supporters, donors, volunteers, board members, and our many, many partners, we are so grateful for you. Let's keep dreaming together. Thank you for supporting Dreamers.